song. What, what, what do you think? I'm kidding. I got a song vault. I just, I get one up. And she was I leaving. I got a 45 with some of the Every old day songs that he first wrote. And I was thinking, this guy's a fucking genius. And when I met her, I said, I'm thinking he's writing it right then, right, because it matters what really, was going on. And she was really arrogant when we first met her. She's like, <laughs> well, you're, you'd be made when he was 17, he'd be walking around in Waterloo with a what? guitar, and I'd be in the kitchen, baking and stuff, and he'd be composing a song mm. at now, 17. Now, mm. Helen I thought said, he was a genius. Helen said, was what are you doing, movie. son? He said, oh, and he would go, uh, but see, the words would be flying through its head. I didn't so show. He I didn't talk. I didn't play her. Playing. I didn't play play her all my songs at once. Like I'd be no, annoying. I'd wait till she was had enough of me, and then I said her something like this one. I said her this one. I said, "Here's one." Do we ever get enough of her? <laughs> and she says, "Who's that by?" And I said, "I wouldn't answer it," right? mm. and she wouldn't honestly know if it was by me or not. And I said her stuff like this. I, well, there's a place down by the bay where I can take my dreams away. Say the really good ones for when the relationship starts going sour, right? Because music <laughs> means a lot to Helen, but she doesn't play or sing. Oh, yeah, she, she's a leader. But it really affects her, really mm -hmm. affects her. So the combination, she danced to music, and to be a dancer, I, you know, I could never dance her, but she identified with music differently than I did. Because see, when you're dancing and you got to move to music, it's just like singing. Actually, you could play, you could write music for her to dance to. I believe that. She's got lots of songs that she likes to dance. I believe she. He can well, write anything. Let's just get her he can write anything. Let's just get her swearing verse. Mm -hmm. But I sent her this one. She said, "Do you have any real sexy songs?" I said, "I don't know. I got a couple." So I let her hear "Hold On to Me," right? Because that song uh, was yeah. never really fit, and that, that's a huge song. It's a real, real sensual, um, romantic song. Here. Go. If I kissed you and I touched you, would you want me? Would you tell me your heart's on the line? I don't know how to say I love you, but I've got this feeling inside. Girl, it's just like I'm saying forever. And I say, it sounds like it's what somebody else say. It's my knee, though, isn't it? It's kind of tough to take, isn't it? And she used to say, you're so fucking arrogant about that. Like, I said, I know. I said, it's, it's just something I just can't get away from. And then just recently, after all of that, I sent it to say, I said, it's not enough that I sing it right now. I said, I went and reviewed them the other day, Helen. I said this on Facebook when we're talking. I said, it's a little overwhelming, isn't it? 